Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Jonathan at GPU Audio. Just wanted to hit you guys up real quick and show you real fast how you can download these new um, FIR Convolver early access plugin. We just released a small update. Uh, the next update's coming in May. And then um, also how you can download some impulse response packs that we have started to release. Um, the packs are really cool. They are actually, you know, s collections that have been pre-named and pre-packaged so that you can drag and drop them into the early access plugin uh, IR folder, you know, which is, is all set up to be um, sort of a manual process right now during early access. Uh, but we're trying to focus on cool impulse responses. So for this first library release, um, this is a collection of um, stuff from the Sonic Palimpsest. And uh, they've got binaural and stereo impulse response recordings um, from the Chatham Dockyards, I believe, or Shipyards in the UK, in Kent. And they sound absolutely gorgeous. They're really, really cool. So I'm going to show you guys what those are about. And then also the FIR Convolver is right here. So first thing you want to do is go to earlyaccess.gpu.audio. You're going to go ahead and log in with whatever you entered as your login. Uh, once you log in, you'll be able to see your account details and then you'll see my products here. Um, when you go to your products right here, you're going to be able to download the latest version, which is 0.9.7.0. Then you're going to be able to download the impulse response packs. Again, these will be updated uh, at least once a week. We're going to keep adding IRs every week, maybe twice, maybe three times a week. We'll just wait, wait and see what happens. Um, so first thing you want to do is go ahead and download that Convolver. Very simple. It'll download. Boom, it's done. X out of that. Then what I want to do is download my impulse responses. Boom, it's done or at least it's trying to. Once you have those downloaded, um, first thing you're going to do is let's go to our, you know, go to the downloads folder, you know, wherever that is on your computer, get the file. I've already pulled it out here. Um, let's go into one of these right here. Let's go into the Palimpsest stuff. So uh, you can see in this collection, we've put a readme together. Um, that readme is showing you all the details about it. Here's the original source credited right here. Uh, big shout out to um, these guys at Kent Research. So We've also got photos of a lot of the spaces, really, really gorgeous spaces um, reflected in this. I'm, I'm super excited about this particular collection. So the reason that we had to package them this way instead of just linking you guys in the Discord to the main version is because of the naming conventions. Um, and then also just wanting to get them into a folder in sets of 10 because the early access plugin only takes 10 impulse responses at a time. And if you have less than 10, you can encounter some glitches. Like, um, it's just weird. So what I've done is I've put them all into this folder here. They're titled Impulse Responses is the name of the folder. Now let's go to our system folder. Let's go to IPC, Local Disk. Let's go to Program Files. We've done this before. Common Files, VST3, GPU Audio, EAP, Impulse Responses. This is where my original impulse responses are. So what I'm going to want to do is I'm going to drag those out, leave them to the desktop or wherever you want, maybe a temp folder. Now there's no impulse responses loaded. Now what I'll do is I'll take this one, I'm going to copy it, and then I'm going to paste, continue. Now uh, my ear early access plugin is going to automatically draw from this folder. So we're all set up, ready to go. We got these badass, uh, you know, impulse responses. Now I can open up Ableton or, uh, you know, whatever DAW you're using. I sometimes use Ableton here, so I guess this is kind of fun. Let's see how we're working on live. Then my, what I might want to do is load up a track, drop in like a drum loop or something like that, VST3, Brainjins, GPU Audio Convolver, and we're here, and all the new IR should be loading just fine. So hope you guys enjoy, um, have a lot of fun, and we'll continue to upload IRs and make sure to post in the Discord uh, any of your creations during this process. So thanks again, and talk to you soon. Bye.